Right, we're now going to record the caption sequence if we can. This is the opening caption sequence over VT. It's one caption and music standing by. And uh, I'm just going to, Helen Floor Manager, I'm just going to put an insert in to see that the graphic is level. Rax, can you tell me on your monitors, does that look level like graphic? Yeah. Right. That's looking pretty good to us. Good, that's looking good. Thank you very much. Stand by. I'm going to put VT up. No. no stand by VT. Stand by grams. Uh, as soon as the zoom starts, we'll start the grams. I think it's about two seconds. So stand by to run VT. Stand by Rax. Stand by Helen. Let nobody in front of that graphic or in front of the light that's lighting it. And run VT, please. Run music. Stand by traffic. Well done, VT. And inserting. Hold that. How long have we had? And, and fade sound of music. Well done. I'm happy with that. Let's take that. That's OK now, VT. We are going to go on to the opening sequence. Take that graphic out. Change graphic. Thank you. We're going to the next uh, opening sequence where the guy introduces the two players. So can you set up on that? It was straight after the, it's the first shot you've got on your tape from yesterday. And it's uh, John, the guy in front of the scoreboard. And we just need to check which one he introduces first. So that was very good, VT. Thank you. Thank you, Rax. Another triumph. <laughs> so stand by. He's got a log in VT, so we'll yeah. be able to find it. It's very good, isn't it? Yeah. Old habits die hard. Uh, He's logged everything. Yeah. Yeah. Let's have a look who he introduces first. Can you just play that, VT? Thank you. When he started Welcome to the 2016 1972 version of the yes, British Old Cobblers Classic Final. Uh, Glyn the Chief. And there it is. Can we get that any lower in frame uh, for? Good. So, can you just go back and give us a still frame of the guy in the white shirt, VT? Thank you. Right, hold that shot. Yeah. Uh, I'm off. You won't see that camera. <laughs> if you can get that any lower in frame, I'd appreciate it. If we can get it down to the button. No, he's caused the. Yeah, yeah. Okay, understood. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. So we've got them in the right order, Helen. Now, uh, what we'll do, we'll give you a rehearsal. So if VT could go back to the top of that segment, I think we'll have sound to help us now. We're just going to run it and I'll add captions as it goes through. The sound is not reliable from it. Um, I can't play it at a normal speed. I can only wind it through by hand. So we won't take, yeah, we won't take sound. I was only taking sound as a guide because it tells me when uh, he's introducing. Um, no, you just play it without sound then, VT. Uh, just wind it through with, and we won't take the sound, that's right. So, just go back to the beginning, if you would. And I'll well, give Helen a rehearsal at the same time. First frame of the close-up. And then it goes. And then on you go. And change, please. And out. So I've got three, three seconds there. I, di I didn't hear the out in time. I can, I can do slower, it. Jeff. Yeah, OK. I'll do it slower on the second so, blow. So what you're saying is you can't run it as live? No, no, no. I can only wind it in. I... We're not going to get this in real time anyway, are we? Um, I wonder no. what the... What's happening right. to the graphic now? There's light in the top of frame. Rax, can you see that graphic? There's light in the top of frame somehow. It's because they tried to dry the graphic down. Yeah. Jeff, yes. I found another way of doing it. I think I can play it to you in uh, real time with sound. Okay. Great, okay. 
We will have a go. It's the yeah, I'm the. If I hit variable speed, let's see what happens. <laughs> Yes, that's going to work. Good. OK, he didn't say so, no, so it didn't matter. Right, so it's, we'll set up and have a have a, a record rehearsal, lads. Yeah, I will. Let me get it back on cue. Instead of playing it in playback normal speed, if I hit variable, it should play it back in times one, and it seems to be OK to lock up at that. Let's give it another rehearsal. He's working. Uh, with the captions, you need to get them level. You can do that with a split screen, but it's far better to ask, ask, ask to the gentleman in engineering yeah. to do that because they've got uh, uh, John, better set up. Could monitors. you just check that, that cap when the caption comes up, that's level. Yeah. Or, or level to 1972 standards. Yeah, this, this is a rehearsed record, so in if modern it, if day it works, terms, we'll just take everything is electronically and, it and it's level anyway. But uh, some of these monitors yeah, sometimes shift. And you think it's level and it's not. This, well, hopefully, will, will give him normal full time yeah. times yeah. one speed, i.e., yeah. normal play, but yeah. using a different yeah. bit of the electronics in the machine to achieve this. Right, we're just waiting on you, VT. Um... VT, VT is ready. Uh... Can you play it from the top, from the introduction, from the, uh, the single? Yes, I can. Right at the beginning, his very first words. Right, from, that, there. from there, stand by, uh, recording, and stand by VT, there's no music on this, just sound, so, and that's a guide sound, so stand by, stand by Helen, run VT. Welcome to the 1972 version of the British All Comers Classic Final. And on my left, one of the competitors, it's Glenn the Chief Brownell! And on my right, it's Sean the Sharp Griffiths! Uh, no, sorry, I got thrown. So. Reset, please. My fault, I got thrown by a whip pan. I went early. My fault. So, stand by VT, we're still recording, and run VT. Welcome to the 2016-1972 version of the British All Comers Classic Final. And on my left, one of the competitors, it's Glenn the Chief Brownell! Change caption. And on my right, it's Sean the Sharp Griffin! Wow. Yeah. That's a good one. We've got it. We've done it. Okay. Oh, good. Now, what we're going to do now, oh. VT, is Let's go to the end of the show. And you're going to offer me up that slow motion sequence you gave me yesterday. Can we just time it from the last dart going in rather than the second dart going in? Or let, let me see what it is. Now. I will do that. Yep. And if you could check those graphics racks to see that the level on your, in your place. Mm -hmm. yeah, Jeff, VT, what do you want me to do? Play it in a slow motion or a freeze frame? Yeah, we're going to. No, you know the slow motion you did yesterday? Yeah. The first dart went in, yeah. but because we were in slow motion mode, there was an interminable uh, delay before the second one came in. Right. But it looked very good, but I've got captions to go over it, so we'll see. So that's the, that's the dart, that's the second one, the winning dart. Let's, and that. What's the next shot? What happens after that? Uh, no, it's not. It's it's enough. So the last shot we're going to have is that second dart. So I'll cue it up so just before the second dart goes in. And no, no. It, uh, it go back because I think I saw him before the first dart. We'll show him that. Right. From yep. there, yep. as it goes, the dart caption. Take the caption out. Dart winning dart Freeze. caption. Freeze. Freeze. Yeah. Okay. We'll do it. Now we go to that. Yeah. We'll, we'll look at the caption. So you set up on that VT, and I'll have a look at these captions. So I've set it up to give an action replay of the winning dart, and then he will now put captions in, timed when he saw what the pictures were. Have we got two or three captions? 
Oh, two. two. Right, yes, thank you. <laughs> that's good, that's a nice shot, thank you. The secret is always write down what the director tells you to do because you cannot go back and ask him to do it again. So what we're going to do now is a closing sequence and we've got two graphics to get in. So we'll see that the second to last dart leave his hand and go into the board. We'll put a graphic in and see the second one go, which is the winning dart. And then he'll freeze the frame. So we have a frozen frame of that and we'll put the second caption up and we'll leave it up. So whoever's editing can take it out. OK, now uh, I think we might add a bit of music to this chaps. Not too too high for, for poor old Jeff, you know. So, are we happy in racks? It's slightly down on the right, but it's possibly acceptable. I'll have a wipe, yeah. Hang on. Uh, four. Oops. That's level enough, isn't it? Yeah. Hey? Yeah. That's good. Right. Yeah. Now I'm happy with that. We're all happy, right? We'll have you at that level, VT's so. disappeared. VT's disappeared at the moment. Don't panic, VT. I've just... Uh, uh, just yeah. yeah. Run the machine down to say it doesn't yeah, sit okay. there. I'll run it so, up when you say I take it we're still recording uh, next door. And stand by. What we're going to do is run this slow-mo. Stand by music. And I'm going to run music first, VT, and then run you. So we'll run five seconds of music, fade it up and then we'll run VT. So stand by, stand by Rax, and run music. Run VT. Change caption. Right, I'd like to do that one more time and I'll cue the music earlier and we'll have 10 seconds of music underneath. Yep. The last caption, yep. the right hand side of the second line is very near the edge of the frame. Right. Are they written like that or is it... it is, uh, they will be written like that, I think. <laughs> uh, if we, uh, if we, but we can. Leave that caption up. Can that caption, just not the camera, can the caption go camera left just a tad, please? How's that, Rax? Now, if, if you leave that as it is and gently put the other one back and be very careful as you take it out. So, stand by music, stand by VT, stand by graphics, stand by Rax and run music. Run VT. Change caption. Well done. I'm happy with that if recording is happy with that. Thank you very much, VT. You are a champion. Thanks, Sam. Thank you, gentlemen. So it took so long. These things always do. Is that a wrap? So, uh, I, I, I know, we'll just have to wait for a clear and make sure there was no dropout and he hadn't got his fingers caught in the two inch tape. Otherwise we'll have to do it all again. Waiting for a clear from VT. <laughs> So that's uh, that. That's good. Thank you very much for the effort, chaps. Jeff VT, can I clear the tape? You can clear the tape, VT. Lovely. I just want to get the tape off the machine while the machine wheels go around. Yeah. Thank you. And can you stay in your positions, chaps, if the uh, prostates allow?